everyone, today I'm doing a quick review of five apps for Android smartphones on my HTC Desire. And the apps I'm going to be reviewing are my top five favorite apps that you probably don't know about. So I have some apps here that um, probably aren't as well known and they should be because I think they're great. So the first one I'm going to start with at number five, you probably do actually know about this one but um, I still think it's great, and I certainly didn't know about it when I first got the phone. It's Google Sky Map. And uh, for those of you who haven't seen this before, it uses the GPS and the accelerometer to, to create um, a map of what the sky looks like above you. So as you can see, as I move it, it moves the map around with it, and uh, it's very handy because you can go outside, point it at the sky, and it'll tell you what's up there. It also has this handy search thing, I can uh, search for things such as, we'll put in Mars, hang on, a bit of problem, May. hard typing on an angle, so we go for Mars there, and so it actually tells you what, what way you've got to move the phone to find that, and it's also got this little uh, thing here, it's got a gallery of some pictures that you can go through, which is quite cool, and then also find that in the sky and it has the same thing, it points to where you've got to move your phone to uh, locate it. Okay, so the next app I'm going to show you is Bubble Level. Uh, this probably won't be useful to everyone, but it basically uh, allows you to use your phone as a level for whatever you're doing. Um, it's probably going to be more useful for people who do DIY projects and possibly camping to level out your uh, tent or whatever. So basically, as you tilt the phone, it shows you where the bubble is, just like a normal bubble level. And also, when you put it on the side, it turns into a level like that. And also, at the top, it turns into a level like that. So it's a very simple app, but uh, also quite useful to quite a few people. The next one I'm going to show you is Sleep Silencer. I had a uh, similar app to this on my Nokia E71. But uh, it's a must-have, I think, for anyone who's ever been woken up in the night by, uh, you know, a text message or an email or something. Basically, what it does is it puts your phone in silent mode when uh, between you pick the hours. There it is, sleep silent. So you pick the hours there which you're likely to be asleep. So I've got between nine o'clock and uh, at night and uh, eight o'clock in the morning, and put your phone on silent between those times. So uh, yeah, quite handy that one. Next one I have here is iTunes Remote. And this one isn't free, it costs about five bucks, but it's uh, definitely worth it. It's the best one out there. And uh, I don't have my computer connected at the moment, but it basically allows you to access your full library from your computer, your iTunes library. And this works with both Apple's and PC's and it allows you to play any of them and control them all from uh, control your computer iTunes from your phone you know it's got all the forward, backwards, shuffle also on the side the volumes it allows you to adjust the iTunes volumes now we're coming up to number one most useful app and this one's a very basic app but uh, it's probably my most used it is, I've got a shortcut on my desktop but it also has this one here, LED light now there's quite a few of these ones, um, but this one doesn't require you to root your phone. I'm not sure why, but it uh, essentially, when you turn it on, lets you use the flash on your phone as a torch, which is quite handy. And it also comes with a little, little widget on your desktop to allow you to turn it on, which uh, matches you know, your Wi-Fi and your GPS switches. So as you turn it off, on and off. And that one's free as well. Okay, so uh, that's it. That's my top favorite, top five favorite apps that you probably didn't know about. I'll link you to all the, um, to them all in the um, blog post. And please comment on modroid.com. Thank you very much for watching. Modroid.com.